All right, hey guys, and welcome back to A Hat in Time. This is episode eight now, and we can finally move on to level f uh, world four. Act. Uh, I don't remember what it's called anymore. <laughs> but we can move on now, which is good. Let me change my volume a little bit for you guys. <clears throat> All right, there we go. I am, I think I'm a little bit sick, so I probably shouldn't be recording this, but screw it, I'm doing it anyway. I did, uh, actually I'm gonna grab some stuff from the coin thing real quick. And remember last episode, uh, the finale happened, <laughs> opened up. So now we can go there, cause Mustache Girl changed the, uh, whole world. <clears throat> the whole planet. That's pretty cute. <clears throat> what does that look like? <laughs> I don't quite like it. Alright, I think... Yeah. I got quite a couple. I went back to some other worlds and got stuff. New Dweller Mask? Oh, that looks really cool. I like the look of that. Oh, that is pretty cool looking. So this is an ice hat? Huh. There's one last thing. Yep. I'm not using that as a sprint hat. Why did it change? Oh, <laughs> it looks so dang stupid. No, I'm not wearing that. I'm wearing this. Alright. So that's all we can get for now. And I did get quite a bit of yarn for going back to the other worlds. So, the place we're supposed to go is over here. The emergency button, perfectly designed for moments when you need a button to push but can't find one anywhere else. Bling. All right. <coughs> I'm not doing that yet. I'll push those all into the same episode. I might need to check a guide to get all the pages from them, so... So chapter 4 is different than the others. They have a free roam version. And which is way different than the others. Alpine Skyline was supposed to be something else at one point. It's supposed to be called Sand and Sails. And if you look in the game's files, you know you can see that Alpine Skyline is called Sand and Sails in the game's files, still. I don't know when Sand and Sails was cut. I just know a lot of stuff was cut from A Hat in Time due to time constraints. And a lot of that stuff was pretty ingenious, in my opinion. So yeah. <clears throat> My congestion is pretty bad right now, just because allergies and stuff. I In the summer is when it's the worst for me, in spring. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's a uh, human bones. That's not good. actually really unsettling. Whoa. <coughs> oh, whoa. What did I just do? Did I activate a volcano? What? Cape is clipping into my head. <clears throat> Did I just time travel? <laughs> I'm I'm glitching and clipping. Oh yeah, I forgot I can move around. how pretty it looks. Now this place is really laggy, not compared to like Yakuza Metro, but it's still pretty laggy. So yeah, here's Alpine Skyline everybody. Has pretty nice music though. Okay, that's the time rift. I don't touch it, I hope. I don't know much about the goats up here, but we tried to give them a wide berth. If you get in their way, they uh, tend to be a bit pushy. <laughs> yeah, they slap you if you're in their way, so... They're not inherently hostile, but if you get in their way, they will slap you. <gasps> Have you noticed those bright flashing lights in the sky? Yeah, those are my timepieces. They started appearing recently after some weird hourglasses fell from... In any case, I really wish they wouldn't be so bright. They're blinding. I like this ac I can't tell what the accent is, but I like it. I think I had a These friend with a similar let you look accent. At far away peaks. Telescopes. So that's the twilight bell. So yeah, that's what they do if you're in their way. These telescopes let you look Those are the goats. These are goats. And I screwed up. This is my worst nightmare. I, I'm just horrible at parkour, so... I have nothing left to sell. Please, visit me at... <laughs> Yay, I can make a time stop hat. Finally. Gotcha! Okay, let me take off the die that I have so you can see what it look what all this stuff looks like normally. I don't know why this is still here. Uh I'm trying to find a cause for it, but this is what this looks like. It's all fancy. And it slows down time for a little bit. Which is useful for like levels that you have to go against the timer, like train rush and stuff. And also it's needed for the other, the Mafia Town, cheating the race, uh, the Mafia Town level. So that's what that looks like. It's 
I got, I got a different hat. See, these are all different hats. This is what this one looks like. It has a flower on it. And the bow. different for a change. I got this one recently, the Widow. It's just all black. I'm basically goth. Everything's still normal though. This kind of matches with it. The time step hat matches. Oh, so the, I didn't show you guys, I went past it, but the description for the time stop hat is called, it says, death is inevitable. Your time is valuable. That's what it says. I'm not kidding. It says that, and it was it was really dark. Honestly, a couple of these the bits in this game are really pretty dark. Like in Subcom Forest, you can see some of the Snatcher minions hanging from trees, and they're not really dead. Actually, you can see their eyes closed. So I'm supposed to uh, blow on this horn to open up a new path. And this one is to the windmill. Or, well, any of them, really. That unlocks paths for me. I hate the lava cake, but I'll probably do that first. Or either that or the... I cleared the goat village. Ugh. I don't know what these, uh, I think they're called the Nomads? I'm not 100% sure. The Twilight Bell is Alright, this is the bird house cage thing. I have to go another way first to blow the- blow a horn. So I can't- I- well I can go either way, but I'd rather go this way first for the collect-a-thon purposes. Hey, this way doesn't play Here's the road to a place where you can get yeah. other stuff. So that was the time stop hat is the last hat you can get. A uh, type of hat. There's of yours here. Purloin village. Oh, I hate this place. I think I spy some treasure. I hate I... lazy pogging so much. The lazy pogging. They just come out and hit you in the face. Yeah. They come out and hit you in the face, and it's annoying. There, there, I see it. Ah! They either steal your hat or your pawns, and sometimes hit you. Um, they're just called the lazy pog gang. I hear crows. Where are the mad crows? Oh, here one comes. Ow, man, that hurt. That didn't actually hurt. I didn't do any... I didn't take any damage, but it still hurt my pride. My friends wonder why I say ow when I get hurt in the video game, and I'm like, it hurts my pride, okay? Hey, man. Oh, ow! I 
gotta be care. I gotta be careful on this because I'm horrible at. Got a lot of pawns. So they don't really have anything to spend it on. I will when I get to Nyakuza Metro, but again, I don't think I'll be recording that. I I might in I'll try, but I probably will crash just instantly because it's already so laggy for me. I have to turn down the performance on it. but I'm getting disoriented from the camera angle. I think it's just because this space is so large I get, like, vertigo. Hey, you took my you took my hat! tokens I have. that I see that perfect Bling. make sure you swing at the roll horn that will unlock the uh, birdhouse and then I go all the way back and then I think there are about five time pieces here no well, eight, including the time rifts. There's five, There's four in the, the boss, quote-unquote, boss battle. This one doesn't really have a boss battle. It's more something else. It's more like run away from everything that's constantly, like, shooting at you. Oh, God. That kind of scared me. What the hell? At least there's no, uh, bully birds or whatever. There's going to be, but not right now. Really? Am I that bad at the game? I thought that was a whatever egg. I can't remember what they're called. Something egg. So now I can go to the birdhouse. I'll probably b like do the birdhouse and something else. Time to go all the way back. I hate the constant backtracking, but eh, what am I gonna do? All right, now I can. Yeah. 
Now I can get to the bird house. The bird cage, bird house, whatever. There's bird houses in the bird cage, so I don't. Bird cage house? I don't know. Sleepy raccoons. Yeah, okay, birdhouse, I was right. Nice. I've only said that, like, twice in my life, like, in that intonation. Mostly because of 69 jokes. sure I wasn't supposed to do it that way, but whatever. Or is that something? I think that's something else. I think this is for like yarn or something. That's a bully bird. <coughs> there we go. The phlegm is out of my throat. That's gross, I know. Calling it a bully bird, but it's not really. All that for a PC arm. All right, this is something else. All right, I have to get this hat out because of the uh, God, what are they called? Shromb eggs, that's what they're called. Shromb eggs, or shromb. S-H-R-O-M-B. They were, they're, they're based off of an older enemy called the Shroms. Shroms. Uh, those were deleted, uh, those were cut, and instead they put a shromb inside of an egg, which made these. Yeah. There's an easy way to kill him, so... Ow. The Death Wish... Ugh. Some of the Death Wishes for this specific level... Actually, I hate so much. With, like, a burning passion in my heart.
<laughs> That's the bird snoring. The big one. I'm just gonna use try and use stickers way more often. Come on. Fine, you don't wanna climb that way? I'll climb this way. I don't know why it's th like that. I think it's just cause. I'm just supposed to go and get the timepiece. So. That's a show. So they're like a root beat like enemy, but they put just put them inside an egg model. Which I don't blame them. Like the normal shrums don't seem to fit anywhere, except Subcon Forest. <laughs> so I'm just do this to pave my way to a timepiece or something. Yeah, that paves my way. All right, I'm gonna go get that, uh, other thing. <laughs> I don't see much else. Like, and I can go back and do this stuff, so... <laughs> off, off camera. Oops. Oh well, that got me back here. Ow! Okay, I'm an idiot. That was in plain sight, I just didn't see it. If Sometimes it glitches and the music turns off, and then all you can hear is this guy snoring. Which is funnier to me than it probably should be. I'm telling it to be quiet so they don't wake him up. That's a unique timepiece pickup. Those look poisonous. And if I sit on them, they would probably hurt like hell. Whoa, what the hell? Clings on. They kind of look like dandelion seeds what that looks like when you blow a tandelion puff the wishes I've always called them wishes so I don't I make something good out of something bad all right the toilet bell I can do that but I want to do the lava cake because I like the lava cake even though it burns the hell out of my character 
It's called the lava cake for a reason, you'll see. Kind of like a chocolate lava cake, but it's literal lava. This heat is great! Ow! Ow. That kind of hurt my ears. That's how you do that. Everything's on fire. Alright, this is the somewhere else, but I'm gonna do this real quick. I don't know where this is. Mystifying time, Mesa. Oh, another. Hey! This way doesn't lead to any peaks. I think the crows are the only thing you can, like, attack like that in. Alright, I know what I need to do for this. And I died, of course. I'm an, <laughs> I'm an idiot. Well, okay, I guess I glitched it. <laughs> oh, I, th I think I glitched it. That's not supposed to happen. Like 30, 30 milli milliseconds. That is what it's called. Milliseconds. I guess <laughs> at a young age I didn't know what it was called, but I called it milliseconds because I thought that's how it was and I was right, apparently. I wasn't a dumb kid. I did dumb things as a kid, but I didn't. I wasn't dumb, I guess. A lot of people think autistic people are slower at developing, and I mean, if that's sort of true, I develop socially differently than anyone else. Oh my god, really? The Mad Hatter badge is really good for this. Oof, alright. <laughs> I kind of like that she does that, putting that much force into blowing on the horn. Alright, I think that goes straight to the windmill, or the one that has the windmill. It's called a time mesa for a reason. That's something else. I think that's the door. You're supposed to get to the other side of that door. I don't know what that is. I'm not gonna touch it for now. All right, so where's the place I did go? What the hell?
here. Okay, this is backtracking. I think I just broke the bridge by a complete accident. This way doesn't lead to any peaks. So the peaks are where the time pieces are at. And I'm glad it doesn't like kick you out of the free roam mode once you get a time piece like it sometimes it usually does. I didn't mean to do that. So that fire is dangerous obviously. This heat is great. Oh, it's even hotter to the right. There we go. I, I used to not be good at that, but I've had to do it for community levels a lot, so I got better. I kind of like how the ones closer to the lava are charred and singed. Singed. So that's the lava cake. There's a there's a giant knife on it too, which is really funny. It it does look like a weirdly tiered shaped cake. Like one of my best friends uh, is a cake maker and stuff. Like she makes cakes and cupcakes. So every year for my birthday, we I get a I get a cake. She gets into my interests and finds out what I like. And then makes a cake based off of that. So. Also, a little notice. Uh, I have to go back, start going back to school in about a week. So, yeah. That's what's going to happen to me. So, uploads may be a little bit less frequent. I also might ha not have an enough motivation to do anything. This is the lava cake! These are hot springs. This is what the can use cannons to get up the lava cake. How the place end up like this? I can't jump on top of these guys because they're burning me. Nearly didn't make that. Alright. Hi, this is clearly yeah. safe. Bang. Second, uh, third level actually.
nearly didn't make that one. Alright, this is one of the last tiers. Dweller Mask. Don't fall off, please. Oh, I think it's encouraging me to use the time stop hat, but I'm good at fast stuff. last tier? Yeah, it's the last tier. The lava cake is, a uh, a lot shorter. Please don't die. I'm horrible. You can't jump or anything while you're like that. You have to sit and wait like three seconds when you're on solid ground. So if you don't find any solid ground in that time, you're just dead. At least it checkpoints on every ah. tier. Yeah, that's why you don't jump on them. So I need 35 to do, uh, there's 40 in the normal game, but you can collect more on the two DLCs. So 40 is the original count. They added 16 more with both DLCs. There's a lot more in Yakuza Metro than there is in the Arct Arctic Cruise. I can never say that. That or Favix. Like, I, I don't know what the fallen captain in that area is called again, but I always said it like I had a lisp, <laughs> and my friends laughed at me every time I tried to say his name. Blow those horns. Pronouncing things is hard. The birds at the birdhouse steal shiny things. So windmill is really long, so I might do Twilight Bell. Well, it's long to me because I'm horrible at parkour. Blow those horns to open. Ow. That hurts, man. Sometimes I forget where the Twilight Bell is placed. Just because I'm kind of an idiot. The Twilight Bell is this way. That's how I know. That line of dialogue is how I know where it is. Just because I get lost, and this, this uh, the skyline thing, the flags, whatever it's called, are higher up than the others. So I need to make use of the dweller mask. The 
The Twilight Bell is just ahead. Really? That's really handy. Ugh. Bang. All right, to the toilet bell we go. The toilet bell's really weird. It looks cool on the inside. They, I wish real bells were kind of like this. Ow, that's loud. So I'll probably do this and then cut the episode off. Mm. That is all I can. Look at that thing! <laughs> so first of all, look inside the bell. That looks really cool looking. like stars. What's that? I think that was re re mi do. Uh, I think. But for musical notes. Or something of the similar. A lot of parkour and dweller mask usage in this one, and the time rifts that it has. So this is where the use of the purple doors and such, or purple walls and such. You have to use your dweller mask to go through them, otherwise they're just solid. And you can only kill those guys with the dweller mask on. Made it. I shocked myself there. God, some of this music I vaguely recognize. Why the hell did it do that, first of all?
So red negates all effect from any of the stuff. So this yarn I'm collecting now is kind of kind of useless. What the hell? Wasn't even non-solid at that point. So that's the sound it makes when I'm walking on it. Kind of like a, a glass noise, like what a, a, wind, a glass wind chime would make. There we go, all right. So this is weird. I gotta do this to open the gates and then do that to close the gates. So fucked. <laughs> Have to do that quick. That's what it did.
There we go. Straight to the timepiece. Targeting on the bells is really weird. <laughs> Yay, alright. Almost 30 timepieces. I've collected every one until up now. Except the cheating the race. I can barely make that. I might have to do that off screen or... Use console commands, one of the two. Just cause I'm, I suck so much. And that'd be like the only time I'd use it. Or do something important off screen. Or I, I might record that bit, but I don't know. All right, I don't know how long I've been recording. I'd say about, about an hour. Maybe. Uh, but I probably will end the episode here and do something else for a little bit and then play while well, the episode edits itself together. Blah, 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 blah. But yeah, alright, I'm probably gonna end it. Alright, yeah, I'm, I'm ending the uh, episode. So that's going to be the end of this episode. Love you guys. Bye.